going to try a new kind of video. I don't know how this camera angle or lighting is going to work out, but we're going to try it out anyways. It's the first time for everything, and I'll tweak it as I learn better. But this is my plum paper planner. This is the design I got, and it just says Crespo family on it, and it has my husband and I's monogram from our wedding. And this is last week's spread and then here's my monthly spread I don't decorate my monthly spread I kind of just open it if I'm making some sort of appointment and just right into it right away so that um, it's quick notes that I would take over to my weekly spread so this is last week's spread you can kind of get an idea of how I decorate and how busy I am. I don't really use this sidebar in the past. Let me see if I can find a good example. For example, I could say this week, this was our anniversary week, so I used green, which was our wedding color, and then it's very sloppy. It ends off being pretty sloppy at the end. Um, in my little can you guys see that? In my notes section here, I wrote down ideas I had, and then I had like a checklist of something I wanted to work on for the week, and I've done that, but I don't really do that much anymore. I don't know if I'll have anything for this week. Usually I'll write my meals down here at the bottom and I separate the evening because I don't have a lot of stuff I put into the evening and this bottom part I use for YouTube planning and I usually do my YouTube planning in pencil. This but this was last week's and now I'll show you. And excuse the background noise, my kids are home um, while I plan. One of the reasons why I've never done a planner video is because they are home. Um, how I start off is I, if I have anything going on like before I actually do my layout and I know that's going to be this week I will put a little post-it in to remind myself. I also write it down on my monthly spread and then down here I just use these little flags to write down what I was planning to film for the um, what I was planning to film for the week because I'm doing vlogtober so I need to have a video for it every day or what I was planning to post I guess I should say and some of it will change and then um, yeah so let's go ahead and start planning. I always like to start with the washi and kind of figure out what color palette I'm gonna go for so this is my little basket of my washi collection and so I know that since next week is Halloween and we also have a trunk or treat this week at the kids' school, I want to kind of do a Halloween theme for this week and next week. So I'm definitely going to use orange. Um, I don't really have Halloween-y type washi, but I have this black and white polka dot one. I don't know if it'll focus. So I have that orange and that black and white, and that, those will probably be just the two washies I use. As you can see, I kind of favor more bright colors. So I think those two will work good. So we'll start with that. You know what, I might do purple. I don't really have purple. This is my Halloween sticker book. This is actually a sticker book I bought for the kids and I just, I buy them stickers for every season so I just go to those when I want some stickers. And it has a lot of cute little hologram stickers so, and they're all different colors. So I think for this week, I think this one will be good for next week and I'll try to share that. I think for this week I'm going to go with um, these hologram ones. So I think I can use, I think I can stick the blue in with this. So those are going to be the washies that I'm going to use for this week. So I always, all right, let me move this. This is very hard to do on film, so I'm sorry, guys. Okay, so 
So I'm going to section off my YouTube area with the blue. And I'm definitely not a pro at this. I'm going to take the orange here and separate this side off. want to section off my weekend so I'm going to again use orange for that I want to try to do mostly orange all right I'm gonna move these because I kind of have an idea of what I want <laughs> just laid out some tape to separate some areas and then now I'm going to take the thick black washi and this is my first time using this one I got this one from the dollar spot in Target probably two weeks ago and I just liked because it was darker color and I don't really have a lot of darker color so I like to put some tape here Once I have my washi laid out, I like to pick, I just got these stickers if you saw my birthday haul. I got these stickers from Hobby Lobby from the Happy Planner um, brand. So I like to pick a quote, I want to pick a quote. So um, last week I used one day at a time because my husband was out of the country for the whole week. Um, this week, I don't know. <laughs> this what you create doesn't have to be perfect one um, for a few reasons one because I love the quote and I feel like I need this reminder daily and the other because it's black <laughs> and I like that so I'm gonna place that here right over the calendar so there's that like I said I don't really use this sidebar here okay so now we're going to actually get into the planning. So I'm just going to grab a pen. So I'm going to go in with a mechanical pencil and I'm going to fill in all my YouTube stuff. So. Also need to I forgot to washi so I'm going to washi over erase that okay I forgot to washi over this checklist part usually I will take some white out and white out white it out but since I'm using black washi I don't think I will need to this time. So I'm just going to washi and this is a little bit different from what I usually use like different washies on every part but I think this will be cute. So I'm going to washi over that and do the same on the other side. So I really like this little black cat sticker, so I'm going to go ahead and put him right here. I think he's cute. And 
then I'm going to use, I just have a black friction pen. I have a ton of pens. I tend to use the black friction, the friction pens the most. I have them in all different colors, but I'm just feeling black today. So for my evening, I have these sports stickers that I bought at a teacher supply store. And I know that we have football on Monday. Tuesday and Thursday and then we have so I'm waiting on dance stickers um, little ballerina slipper stickers to come in for my for Wednesdays for to mark off my daughter's dance classes but I have been using, I have these fairy stickers that I got a long time ago from a teacher supply store. So I've been using these um, since I started to separate this. I'm not using the big one, so I'll either use a flower or a um, butterfly. I think I'll do this butterfly. I also know that on Saturday morning we have a football game. So I like to mark off football game up here okay so now we're gonna get into the real planning so oh, I've marked off all of those evening activities then underneath the evening activities I always put kitchen and that's because that is basically my nighttime routine is taking care, is making sure I get my kitchen clean. little helping hands stickers at a uh, teacher supply store and I use these to mark off the days that I'm going to do my volunteer program so <laughs> for my big cleaning day. This is going to be our family day.
that's so far what my spread looks like. Now I'm going to figure out dinner, so let me get my meal plan. Okay, so for meal planning, I always just take, I just have a binder and I take a regular piece of paper and I write out 14 meals because we shop every two weeks with just a small shop in the middle. And I will just pick from here based on what I have going on those days, what I will put down for my meal plan. weekend flags from Planner Frenzy and I'm telling you filming a video while planning makes me forget everything <laughs> so I'm gonna add my banner flag I knew it looked empty going to go ahead and write in over here that I want to, I need to um, find out about the pumpkin. So let me let me do this. Pumpkin for Girl Scouts, and I also need to email for my eagles. So here's my weekly spread. Just a little bit of Halloween in there. I really like that black washi. I think it looks really, I think it looks pretty cute. And um, I will add to it if I need to, but I'm glad I got it pretty laid out for this week. Let me know what you guys think of this plan with me. I'm not sure how the lighting or angle was. Let me know if you have any tips for ways to make it better. I'm thinking of doing this maybe once or twice a month. I don't know if I'll do them weekly. We'll see about that. Um, but that is my planner. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below if you're not already. Give me a thumbs up for my very first plan with me video. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye guys.